Anton Daniels, once again, is simping for women. What's good, everybody? This your boy, Opposite from the Norm 18. Before I get started, make sure y'all go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell. All right, so this episode is something else. We keep seeing Anton do this off and on. He'll tell the truth, then he'll come back and say some simp stuff. And then now he got Mr. Let Go helping <laughs> to simp his back or back his simping, if you will. Let's go ahead and get into it, y'all. You think people should just be put in jail because their baby dad doesn't like them? Are you no. serious? No, <laughs> no, wait, 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 wait. When did that get crazy? Wait, wait, first of all, no, first of all. Because look, I've been waiting in the back. And, I, and it, now if you want to talk to me, nigga, talk to me. Oh, and I'm God. telling you, you niggas are weak and soft. Nah, y'all weak for having no, folks no, with no, the wrong chair. Wait, 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 wait. Y'all weak. Nah, no, 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 no. Because you know what? Let me, let me tell y'all. No, now you acting like Kayla. You said, nah. no, no, no. I'm not going to let you talk. I'm nah, not gonna I mean, y'all weak. Play out. I'm, 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 I'm an, enough whining. What is the next time? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like the next I time is I mean, women y'all, 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 part what y'all did is y'all misrepresented everything that just went on. The damn topic was about accountability, and it the wasn't. topic yeah, this nigga was. Fuck. It wasn't. All right, so let me brief y'all just real quick. They was talking something about accountability. Jr. played a video where two guys was talking to each other. They talked about roles in the house. They went from that conversation to talking about the accountability of women and how they get away with certain things that they should be held to the same standard as men, like breaking crimes. So uh, I believe it was Quest or Logic, one of those two, that brought up the fact that when things happen as far as the man being a sorry father, he gonna get held accountable, put on child support, he can lose property, he can lose his license, his passport, or even go to jail. When a woman is a sorry mother, nothing happens to her. So then, K asked, what does he think should happen to those women? And he said the same thing that would happen to the father. So now, Anton and Mr. Let Go is gonna go into talking about man caping, uh, crying too much and complaining too much about women. It was about, well, it was about it you said accountability. The first it word was accountability. It had nothing to do with women being accountable. It had nothing to do with accountability. If you don't want to hold on. If you listen to it, they don't care anymore. We don't care. Nobody cares. Good accountability as a man. If I have an issue, I shouldn't have to worry about saying something you don't like. Y'all some boy. And also worry about your feelings. Where did this say holding women accountable at? Bruh, listen to. Now, if you shut up for one minute. Oh, my God. God. Listen, right. You're interpreting it in a listening logic. Oh, no, uh-uh, because you yeah. niggas are slow. One mic, y'all. One mic. Listen to. You're leading with emotions. Would you one fuck mic, y'all. Right. Just like, right. 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 You, know. you are. You're interpreting it. And see, that's another problem. Logic always follows what K has to say, and he can't even get his words out, especially when everybody going at him because they disagree with him. They trying to shut him down as always. But that ain't even the point of the video. Instead of listening, like no, 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 no. Hey, all I'm saying, can, can everybody for one minute, if you listen how Jr. led in the question. <laughs> He led, <laughs> led in the court. Listen to that. Listen to the fucking moderator. Jack led the question in, and he said, "Y'all always want to be." Oh, right, real quick, I'm tired of Jr. saying that. Jr., if you are the one leading the conversations, you're implying or or you're uh, interjecting the questions for the panel to answer. You are the moderator. If you're the one telling people to chill out. You're the moderator, bro. You are the moderator. Like, ooh, what about the question when somebody starts less than tomorrow, calling out what y'all are doing? We've been <laughs> off the topic of the question for like the last hour. Like, we've been having a whole conversation. That's how it goes. But then when it 
you would say something contradictory and somebody has something to say about it, now it's, let's get back to the question. Like, what? Is that the strategy? Like, do we just say, let's get back to the question when we don't have anything else to say and we can't defend our arguments? Is that how it goes? <laughs> K is so damn annoying with her goofy ass. K, you know damn well. The man, y'all was talking about something. They trying to answer it. And now you trying to play this old politics double talk crap. And you know doggo well what they was talking about. She's annoying as hell, man. I love it. The fact that you couldn't even say all that with a straight face, you have to start laughing. Just goes to show. They gonna ask the rose in the background. Look, look, maybe it ain't got nothing to do with the with the with the ladies. I heard two men up in here saying that you niggas is why the boy got this problem. Oh, they they harmless. They like a cat. They they can't do that. You niggas are slow. And I know you can't be from Atlanta talking like that. Because, nigga, in Atlanta, we call niggas like you fool. Hey, I'm telling you. It don't matter. I ain't never had a woman like you said to me. Not one thing. Not ever in life. Not one fucking thing. Not one thing. Not okay, but, have they but, 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 but I guess the know, weird part about it is that you as an example have y'all ever yeah, heard of none of your friends? All right, we're gonna go ahead and let our girl cute. Um, say what you gotta say, then we'll move on to the super chat. No, I know y'all men haven't encountered this, this super but chat. you guys don't have friends that encounter these women. You saying that all women are harmless is crazy. I don't have friends. I don't have guys in my circle like Anton, that. Okay, not you. I, I okay, don't either. I said, Ed, okay, not you. But you don't. So if y'all don't have friends, this isn't applying to you. But we hear these stories about these crazy women. This woman just my stabbed friends a man. Are was, oh, slap, was slapping, was slapping a man in the elevator, and he wasn't doing nothing. To say women are harmless, I'm not saying all women. That are, I bet when they got crazy. the elevator, they were still they together. Are, they're, okay, but that's not the point. The point well, is, well, he could have got the elevator and said, Get, "I'm, I'm okay. out of here." But his okay. dumb ass stayed with the damn woman. All, all women are angels. I've never seen so many. All right, real quick, I'm, I'm gonna have to talk about what Mr. Let Go said on that. That was, that was, that was so stupid. <laughs> How often do we see guys when they're in a relationship with a woman, they walk away? And then the woman go to, oh, you just let, you just gave up. Or if a man walks away from a, a woman and his children because the court ain't helping the situation, they always having problems, you know what I'm saying? And she shouldn't involved in the court in the first place, but she did it out of spite, put him on child support. And then they, he can't even co-parent peacefully because something wrong with the help. So they're trying to say that if a woman is dealing with a man, she has a problem, man should just leave alone. Now, I agree, but to a certain extent. We're not gonna sit here and act like women don't have mental issues and they don't become somebody else or the way women are moving nowadays, you have to be more careful about. So this is why we say what we say, but Mr. Let Go is cap because he always talks about holding women accountable. And the way he's trying to spend it now, then that means you don't got nothing to say. You shouldn't say nothing then. If that's the problem, just when you make a video, make your video should last no, no more than 32 seconds. Hey guys, if a woman's crazy, just don't mess with her. Thank you. Thank you. No, no, thanks for coming out. Mr. Let Go, I'm out of here. No, you make videos all the time about accountability. Why did you make a video with Tanya TKO? You know she got issues. You wouldn't even waste your time with her, right? Right? But I digress. Men and they feelings, bro. Like in 2022, it's almost like the women are stronger than the guys because the guys is always crying and emotional about the women and it's like when the fuck we start caring about what women think stand on your I own I never care say about what you what don't say think. I, what, what, if, if about that's what true think about what, anything I, I never when did we start caring about what women think alright so that's what I really really wanted to get to and I'm gonna end the video here Anton get on my nerves with this shit he'll be cool sometimes and then sometimes he'll come back and try to do this I'm super simp shit bruh if that's the case you talking about crying and complaining what about when you had that problem with Kay and Kayla on the show and you talking about almost giving up on women or black women whatever you titled it and then Rita had to say I'm sorry for women or these women to make you get your mind back right you was crying and complaining you talking about you almost gave up so how do you turn around 
and try to talk trash about other dudes saying their 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 grievances when it comes to women. When you almost gave up on women, now you try to act like he did. Like I say, he tried to come back and be super rich or super simp, whatever. Oh, I ain't got these problems. I don't got guys like that around me in my circle. Yes, you do. Because you're right here on the show. It's in your life. Every week. Hey, you almost gave up. You look so depressed. He did a video the next day. I remember watching it. Now, shout out to, to his beautiful wife, Rita. But, bruh. You're blessed in your situation. So maybe you shouldn't speak all the time. Don't speak on it. That's cap. And you know how these females are. We all know how these females are. Kay and Kayla will give you a headache every freaking week. And it gets hard to watch the videos because they mess up the conversation. Siobhan ain't even all that bad. But when they come on us, she another being. And, you know, of course, they're going to keep us single. I know Kay and Kayla, they got a man. I think Kay just got married, so I know her man is sent. Kayla, if she can even get a man, he going to have to be a simp for him to stay together. But she ain't going to want to because she's too manly for him. She ain't going to want to do like that. But Anton and Mr. Let Go, y'all really let me down. <laughs> because y'all trying to sit there and act like y'all talking about women. The way y'all do is not the same way the rest of the men do. So, fellas... We taught each other that our grievances out because I'm telling you, I'm predicting this guy went five to ten years. Men are going to go back old school where they ain't going to say a damn thing to women. We're trying to express ourselves to women like they say they want. Now it's a problem. So, it's going to go back the way y'all think it should have went, stayed, and we're going to be happy to oblige. This is your boy JTL, a.k.a. Opposite from the Norm. Make sure y'all subscribe, hit that notification bell. You know I'm going to always come back. Do my best every day to drop some. So show your boy some love. Show your boy some appreciation. I got my cash app in the link as well. Out front of Norm 18, the number 18. I'll be back. Chill!